I'm not with the flakes. It's not flaky, it's flaky. Hi loves! Welcome to my channel. My name is Christina Moore. If you don't know, if you're not subscribed, make sure you hit the subscribe button so you can get more updated videos from me. And if you're already subscribed, welcome back. So by the title of this video and my attitude, we are going to, uh, let's just get into the fact that my face is not super beat. I'm about to leave the house. I look super bummy. So you guys can already tell where I'm gonna go with this review. So on Black Friday, every Black Friday, if I need something, that is when I am going to buy it in bulk. So if I need a lot of hair products, I'm gonna buy it on Black Friday. If I need a lot of makeup, I'm gonna buy it on Black Friday. If I need shoes, Black Friday, because they're a sale. So on Black Friday, I decided this year to buy a whole bunch of natural hair products. Sidebar, you're just now seeing them because a lot of them came late and I decided to do other reviews instead of them. So today I am reviewing two out of the four products that came in this um, box that I received. So I ordered this on Black Friday, like I said. The packaging on this, I will say, is really, 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 really cute. I'm a sucker for really, really cute packaging. And also how she advertised it around Black Friday was so cute, so I was like, why not? I wish I paid more attention to actually what was in the box and not like what the products look like. And I wish I did more research. That's not their fault, that's just my fault with blindly going in and buying stuff, especially on Black Friday. You know, once it's gone, it's gone. So this box came with four styling products. I'm already pissed at myself for that because why do I need four styling products? I don't. I don't. I don't. I don't. What I needed was a shampoo, a deep conditioner, styling, and like something else. I don't know. But I didn't need all four styling products, so that was my bad for not doing the research on um, this particular line. So in this box that I got, it was a curl smoothie, curling custard, leave-in conditioner, and um, a twisting souffle. All of which I don't need, but again, that was my fault. So onto the products that I did try, because I'm not putting four styling products on my hair. I just decided to do, I wanted to do a wash and go, but I'm glad I didn't. So I decided to do my little ponytail. I'm going to show you guys some clips of what I did to get the style. It's not going to be in full detail because I already have a tutorial on my channel on how to get that style already. I will link it down below if you're interested. But anywho, I decided to use the leave-in conditioner and the curling custard. my channel taking out my braids so I washed my hair as you guys saw if you watched that video if you didn't go ahead and watch that video so you know what I'm talking about so I washed my hair normal and since there was like no deep conditioner no shampoo no nothing um, I only had two products to use so I used the leave-in which is okay it's very light it smells good you know smell is it does count it does count because you don't want to put anything on your hair that smells bad so it's not a terrible product will I go out and buy it again no not anything against it it's not that I hate it but I don't love it enough to go out and literally buy it again so once this is done for me it's done it's very lightweight um it smells good like I said and if you don't like heavy things on your hair, I would suggest to use that. But other than that, it's cute, but it's not like something I'm super in love with. Now, this curling custard, y'all. I'm not using anything with the word custard on it unless you guys ask me to because you guys are family. Um, I'll do it for you. I'll do it for the gram. I'll do it for the YouTube. 
do for snap whatever i'll do it for you guys but other than that i'm not coming out of pocket and, and buying it and even though i'm in a certain stage on my youtube with natural hair i don't have products sent to me so all this stuff i buy with my own money as you guys can tell i'm not like my face, I have makeup on it. This is like a no makeup makeup type of thing. Not even. This is literally a five minute makeup situation. Y'all know when I'm feeling myself and I like styles, my face is beat, lashes is on, my fit is popping. None of that is happening today. What I know for a fact is when a lot of these companies make like the natural gels, my hair is just like, sis, what you doing? What you doing? Mm-mm. 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 Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. And I did I listen? No. Because I already know what was going to happen. I don't know if it's the porosity of my hair, the texture of my hair or what. But anytime I use these products, even when I use like the Camille Rose gel, y'all know I love Camille Rose. I love some Camille Rose on my hair. But when I use that gel, my hair was not having it. It shrunk. It's not cute. This um style here is not defined at all and usually when i have this ponytail i can wear it for three or four days this is the second day and it looks like i've been rolling around on my pillow crazy usually when i have these little hangy things and i do hangy things usually when i have my um some pieces longer than the other you guys know my hair is not one texture at all um i just i can just stuff it <laughs> i can just stuff it back in and kind of make it even with the gel but i can't even do that because it's not even defined it just looks wild crazy it looks crazy i'm like really really upset because i have to go and redo my hair all over again i didn't get a chance to you know really bask in the style i didn't get a chance to rock it out it's not cool it left a lot of white residue i understand that not every gel um curling custard whatever is not going to give you super defined curls i understand that but I didn't feel like any parts of my hair was like defined. I hate buying a product and I have to go in and do my hair all over again within one or two days because one, I don't want to wash my hair all over again. Two, I have a lot of hair. I have too much hair to be just sitting under the shower washing my hair and you guys know I have a child too so I can't just be going to wash my hair whenever I want. So I'm a little annoyed about that. I'm also annoyed about the fact that yesterday, um, even though my hair was dry whenever I touched it, my hands were like sticky. Yes, it's a gel, but that's never happened with any other gel that I have. Once my hair is dry, I can like touch my hair and call it a day. So some of the girls that I glanced at that use this product and they're kind of winning with it are girls that have looser hair textures. Um, sorry, it's just the truth. I'm kind of tired of tiptoeing around that uh, issue. I just shouldn't say issue, but that situation in the natural hair community, there are just some products that work better for them, period. And don't get me wrong, I don't have the kinkiest of the kinkiest hair texture, but my hair, I do consider parts of my hair to be kinky. This looks like I've... This looks like my hair has been... All right, all right, perfect. I know y'all see this. I know y'all see this. What is this? Sis. 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 You see that residue? I know y'all I know y'all see this. I can't make this up. And this is not something I'm doing because at the end of the day, like I said, I've been natural for seven years. About to be eight years. I know my hair. Um I'm not gonna I'm never gonna tell anybody not to buy a product because it may work perfect for you. I'm just, you know, one of the few people that I guess this product does not work for and I'm not with the flakes. It's not flaky, it's flaky. Okay? Let me know if you tried them, if you have them, if there's a particular way that you're using them that I haven't, even though I feel like I've used it correctly, but I don't know, maybe I did it. Maybe there's a trick to getting more defined curls out of this product, but as for right now, my curls are not defined at all. The longevity of this product in my hair, that's the only thing where I'm going to use the word trash. So that's it for this little one brand tutorial or should I say review. So let me know if you want me to do more of these type of videos. I have tons of products that I bought that are sitting there. So you're going to get more of these reviews and you're going to get real reviews. So let me know how you feel in the description.
in the description box. So let me know how you feel in the comments down below. I'll see you guys in my next video. Stay blessed. Bye.